there are few things that are more chilling than setting foot in a city or abandoned place. These communities full of life lie frozen in time, crumbling in the face of adversity. Some tell us horrible stories about their difficult past, from towns persecuted by conflicting times to communities that have been left to their own devices, on some of the abandoned places will surely freeze your blood. Number 1. Belkheit, Aragon, Spain, the history of this Navarreset town is synonymous with witchcraft, scratched, beaten and scarred, the old town of Belkheit watches the passage of time as its buildings fall apart. This small town was the scene of one of the most symbolic battles of the Civil War, when it was destroyed. More than 30 neighbors were sentenced to life imprisonment or to die at the stake by the Inquisition when accused of performing covens, the dark legend of this hot springs spa begins as a result of its abandonment after the Civil War, during which it was used as a hospice to receive tuberculosis patients. After the end of the contest, is abandoned and robbed by vandals. Lovers of the mystery began to explore its ramshackle interior in pursuit of the Lady in White, series of spots that suggest human faces that appeared on the floor and corridor of a house on Calle Real, as the owners indicate, they have tried to cover them, they always return to arise. The first pigmentations began at the beginning of the 70s and was considered as the most important paranormal phenomenon of the 20th century. Number 2. The Island of the Dolls, Mexico, the Island of the Dolls was the home of a hermit, Julian Santana Barrera, who lived isolated among the channels of the Chilango district of Xochimilco. Legend has it that he found a girl who had drowned and from that moment he dedicated himself to hanging dolls around the island to appease her spirit. This place became a tourist attraction for many tourists who came here with dolls to add to the collection. In 2001 Barrera was found drowned in the same place where the girl was supposed to have appeared. The island can still be visited, although the feeling that all those dolls are watching you is something strange. Number 3. Hashima Island, Japan, also known as Gunkajima, this abandoned mining facility is an overwhelming jungle of crumbling cement buildings and dust-covered debris left by its inhabitants. It has been unoccupied since 1974, when people were forced to leave because the place was so inhospitable that it was difficult to live there. Conditions on Hashima sound massively rubbish, at its peak there were over 5,000 people living on this bollock of rock, that's just 1.5 meters per person, making it the most densely populated place the planet had ever seen, before or since. Not everyone that lived there had any choice either, recruits from other areas of Asia were forced to work and die there. Basically a large corporation, Mitsubishi made buttloads of cash out of other people's suffering. Number 4. Pripyat, Ukraine, abandoned after the Chernobyl disaster in 1986, Pripyat was once the lively home of 50,000 people. But everything changed when the biggest nuclear disaster in history hit the Ukraine. For many, this terrifying time capsule serves to recall the distrust of the local population towards the government, since the empty city remains literally frozen in time, the force of the tragedy caused all the clocks in the city to stop. The strangest place in the city is its amusement park, with its ferris wheel and its roller coasters empty and silent. Number 5. The Haunted Shades of Death Row, New Jersey, US, the winding two-lane terror is located smack in the middle of Warren County, New Jersey, and runs for seven miles alongside the eerie tree line of Jenny Jump State Forest. There are a few places with a much more menacing background. One of the darkest corners of the Garden State is a stretch or road where murder is mundane and the ghosts of the dead still roam, the haunted Shades of Death Road The tragic tales from Shades of Death don't end with the three previously mentioned cases of murder, but stretch deep into the local legends that have haunted the road for decades. It's said that the low-hanging branches of the Jenny Jump Forest were often used for late-night lynchings, and a few strange, Barren portions of the nearby land have long been rumored to have hosted human sacrifice and black magic ceremonies by mysterious hooded figures. Subscribe for more.